video gaming can be addictive in the same way as cocaine or gambling. The World Health Organization, or WHO, makes the announcement in an update of the International Classification of Diseases, a benchmark for diagnosis and health insurance. Online and offline gaming disorder is grouped with disorders due to substance use or addictive behaviors in the ICD's 11th edition. It's the first major revision in nearly three decades. Key symptoms include impaired control, notably the inability to stop playing, and focusing on the game to the exclusion of everything else. Symptomatic behavior must continue for at least a year. In extreme cases, gamers unable to pry themselves away from a screen drop out of school, lose jobs, and become cut off from family and non-gaming friends. Director of WHO's Department of Mental Health, Shekhar Saxena, says some 2.5 billion people, or one in three worldwide, play some form of game, but the disorder only affects a small minority. The games industry raked in $108 billion worldwide in 2017, more than double movie box office receipts. The inclusion of gaming disorder met with resistance, both from industry and some experts. President and CEO of the Entertainment Software Association Michael Gallagher says, The WHO process lacks transparency, is deeply flawed, and lacks scientific support. 36 researchers who are about to publish their findings said there was insufficient evidence to warrant the new category.